Today we're breaking bad habits. We've got dishes and knives. First order of bit of flatware, knives. Oh. We got plates. I just want a broke neck plate on the tongue. <laughs> <laughs> he said, I used to leave all of the times, like I would take from this in the video. And I just put that. Do, 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 do. I was very predictable. So now, actually I'll wait so I can do a little montage um, I'm loading the dishwasher, like putting the dishes in. Look at you. Put it inside like the hey, who's proud of me? <laughs> Are you coming to me? I'm in the It's like awesome. Oh yeah, awesome. The penne's lost on the side. On the on the side of it, scoop it up with some sauce. But it's not a bowl, so you can go for the salad. It's a salad. On the side. Yeah, you can just, you can do everything in here. You can do a rice bowl. You know how cute a rice bowl would look up in this? You don't. I can't go clean. You like rice? Girl, it's like, a as, a as a Trinidad, like, first of all, rice is the main. They don't like pasta. <laughs> they like OT. I don't like anything with rice. I mean, that's a lot of it. If I get, if I got oxtail, and it's rice and peas, and it's soaked up the oxtail juice, I'll eat it. White rice? You give me white rice? No, but I like, it's cool. not, you're not giving white rice though. I'll also talk about rice you can make. Like, you make rice and peas? Yeah. Oh, see, you got it. I don't got it. Rice is a complex food group. Got it, got it. Okay, but even like a chipotle bowl, like, you wouldn't like. No, I guess I do eat rice in that. Okay. So. I think the issue is just like. <laughs> Like rice when it's like the main commodity. You know what's good though? What? Sushi rice. <laughs> <laughs> Sushi rice obviously is but only because it's soft. It's my secret slave. Oh. Little avocado toast. Big body bands. Oh, big body bands. But I think yeah. it's more just like the the angling the angle, and the lighting. And the, like you're also supposed to zoom in a little. I oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, I heard you're supposed to always zoom in a little bit. Okay. Because like I be trying to take them and it's just not. This looks so bad. It don't look the way, and, and then that's why I be stealing them from Pinterest. Yeah. I'm like everything was getting it. I was like, why are we running out of knives yeah. every two seconds? Everything. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. I'm just trying to live life. Free there. <laughs> Somehow I know. I didn't know what she was doing and then she became Hannah Montana. So. That's a great point that you just made. <laughs> they need to stop. Who is for a baby? Like, no, but like, like who closet. was in there wrapping each one of these? <laughs> That's so, like, did they not know the crisis we're having with the they environment? They did not They did they not know. know the crisis we're going because through with our planet. who in the right mind was like, you know what? Just wrap all the package. Just wrap all. each of them. Like each of them needs to be wrapped separately, actually. I actually like this one. Yeah, but they also feel very, um... Yeah, it feels expensive. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, not like the Ikea ones I got. Kind of interesting. These are not like the Ikea ones. It's Netflix so stupid with this outfit. Thanks for letting me know, guys. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be one long video. speckled don't play i just really rock with the black i haven't 
The one that I bought was specifically for dishwasher. Why does it say hand wash on me? <laughs> what do we do? Hand wash. I think I've been thinking life to try to avoid returns. <laughs> I just wash them. <laughs> Everything will be linked down below on my Amazon. Go off, influenza. You know what I mean? Like, yes. let's just cut to a time lapse. Y'all are tired of me. This is 21 minutes of footage. You better sing, girl. I didn't think about the wrench. Which is like higher up than I thought. Like I was pushing uh, down. And so I. was my secret And it goes down. Ah. That's the try? Yeah. It's like. Got it. Got it. Oh, I see you spinning. All right. We got some things. I feel like it's not looking at you guys. It's not. Yeah. Hey! I don't even remember half of the things we got. Oh, they're lying, right? Oh, yeah, that's. Hey y'all, not the chain though. Okay, so I've set up for work. I've written everything down that I need to write down. And we're gonna get into it. A lot of today, it's just Monday, client work, you know, touching base with clients, finishing things that I need to get back to them, um, creating content, posting for them. Right now, I have to log into like three of my clients' accounts because somehow I got logged out. So it's logging into the accounts, I have to finalize posts for them, and then I schedule a snack because I never schedule in snacks or food, and that's the worst thing because I'll just work through that time. And then I actually have two videos that are not, wait, one of them I'm posting on my account, one of them I'm just sending for a UGC deal that I filmed on Saturday and it's due today and I haven't started to edit it. So we have to edit that, get it to them. And I don't really know the vibe of it because I don't think I did that good of a job filming it, realistically, to be quite honest with you. Um, but we're gonna see, it's like 30 minutes and it only needs to be a minute. So like we should be able to get a minute out of 30 minutes but you'd be surprised. Um, and then I have to, I just have to a lot of edit, lots of editing. I usually just sit on the computer and I edit all day. It's sad, but it's true. I just post that on her YouTube channel. <laughs> so we're watching. I can try it pop up. Pop a or anything. Not the yitty titty. She's gotta always make sure. I'm taking a little break even though that was not in my schedule. <laughs> so, you know, I'm behind schedule because I'm taking a break. It wasn't you know? in the cards. It was not in the cards. I don't even 
flathead screwdriver. I just have a regular Phillips screwdriver. This is crazy. I don't even know if I'll be able to talk and do this at the same time. Like, what? I'm gonna cry. Hello, and welcome to my room. Welcome to my ground, my floor, honestly. We're building a desk today, okay? This is what happens when you move. You build things. Like, I was prepared for like, you know, getting things, buying things, but I wasn't prepared for building things, and that's where I'm just, that's where I'm at. I don't know if I should be, like, keeping things out of this. Anyways, what are they trying to say to me right now? They are so crazy. <laughs> in a row which is fantastic and oh my desk is built let me show you isn't it so darn cute it's really really cute it's so small my computer literally leaves this much space but i really didn't want something that like took up all this space so i want something small and i land on this desk the issue that we're now finding is that If I'm like sitting at the desk, it's shaking. Good morning. Um, I don't even know what this video is, but I do know that I've been filming and showing you my days. Like I said, I've gone to the gym three times in a row, so I have to do two more times to really make it a habit, like five times at least. It's actually 21 times to make something a habit, to do 21 times of the same thing to get your brain and to be like oh i do that daily so it takes 21 days to build the habit so i have to go to the gym 21 times but about three which is amazing start so if you're trying to do something you're trying to get a habit you're trying to build the habit you got 21 days and buckle down for those 21 you know what i mean like <laughs> oh my gosh anyways do what you gotta do and then there you are you're set I look crazy and my nasal passages are not doing well. The air is stagnant. This morning I woke up, I was like, I'm gonna film you, I'm gonna be very productive today. I have a lot of things to do. And one of them is go to the gym. And I last night downloaded this app called the Structured app. Structured. Um, because I need structure. I'm gonna put some lip gloss on. You guys know Merit, it's a great, great brand. I love, I love. Mm. They just came out with this new, it's like freaking 7.40 in the morning, I'm talking about lip gloss, like someone help me. I don't want, why would I keep, I just keep using all of it at home. Like this is not for home, I have cheaper lip gloss for home. This is when I want to be cute outside. Honestly though, like I want to be cute inside too, so I'm going to still use it. But this merit, did you see my lips? They ate, like absolutely ate with that formula, it's so... The sun's out, which is beautiful. I hate my hair like this. I'm giving the founding fathers, so <laughs> don't mind me. Anyways, what else I need? I downloaded this app called the Structured App. Like, I use my notebook, as you know, to write out my to-do list because it just works better in my brain. But then I have to time block, like I usually time block in my Google Calendar. I say how long it would take me to do that task, and then I put it in the calendar. For me, like that's how I realize that I can be productive because if I don't time block and I just say this is my to-do list, I'll spend seven hours on just one task and then I won't accomplish any of the other tasks. And so sometimes I have to stop and the motivation of stopping is because I realize I need to get to the next task or other times I'm like, oh, you need to like pick up the pace 
because the next task time block is approaching. And I know I was doing it in college too, but I just like, didn't really have the name for it. So I'm back on time blocking. So this morning I set it to like a 7.30 wake up. I naturally woke up at 7.30, I was like, let's go. But then the next thing was gym at 8, 7.45. And so I had to snooze in this room. Why didn't I show you the app? This is the app. And so I'm supposed to be at the gym doing it at 12, 3, 30. And I was supposed to go at 7.53 because I pushed the time back. And it's 8.03. And it's telling me that I have 19 minutes remaining. So that's not correct. Today we're gonna be productive. Um, come with me. My bathroom has this like ongoing fan that's usually loud. Okay, look at the top of clothes that I have here. For no reason, oh my god, my life. Today's objective is to be productive. But my teeth have been doing really well. And I've been using this water pick flosser. If you struggle with flossing, this is it. Like, I think it's a game. I love using it and it really gets everything out and honestly this might be disgusting this might be too much but i love seeing all of this stuff get out of my teeth um so if anything i put you on to a water pig flosser like if you're the person every time you go into the dentist she's like you need to floss you need to floss and you're like and you know you're about to go home and you're not about to floss get one of these invest in it i'll probably link it down below and i'm serious because teeth health is important i like to say it's not but it is and your teeth you really only i mean you get to I remember the first time i got a cavity in my baby teeth they're like it's fine it's just your baby teeth i was like period and then i got a cavity in my adult teeth and i was like nah. water picker foster you just fill it up with water and you literally just The structured app is like, girl, where's the structure? Welcome to my life. We obviously know. Laneige. I'm a lip gloss girl. Like through and through. One thing about me is I know the lip glosses. I'm testing out the lip glosses. I love my lips to be glossy in different ways. Let's go to the gym. Let me stop. Also in her gym clothes. We're ready for the day. Also, let's just get into the shrimp, okay? Today we're breaking bad habits. Today we are pushing through the urge to procrastinate, pushing to the urge to push things off because I my to-do list is long, it's extensive. Alright, so I have a list of the companies that I want that my clients to work with, and I'm gonna get to going on the phone. Yeah. <laughs> I'm scared. Cool. Nice to nice to know you. Let's do it again. Let me do it. I use Safari. Comment below what you use. I use Safari and I feel like everything is like Chrome extension. And I'm like, Safari, you don't got extensions? 21 days, y'all. 21 days to form a habit. Start now. Honestly, when you think about it that way, it's like, okay, you push for 21 days to be someone that like technically you're not, but you wanna be, right? For 21 days, push to be someone that you're not but who you want to be. Basically, it's going to be hard and your body is going to want to 
push on the fact of you going to the gym, you eating healthy, waking up early, like all these things your body's gonna push because of it's a bad habit. We've just formed it because for 21 days and more <laughs> and more, you've done it. You've woken up late, you've snoozed your alarm, you've created that habit. We have to think about bad habits just how we think about good habits. And so when we think about bad habits, you're doing them subconsciously like unconsciously you're doing that one thing that you don't want to keep doing right let's just take for example waking up early you want to get out of the habit of waking up late and snoozing your alarm so what do you do you set your alarm for an earlier time and then you hear it go off in the morning and you have to make a choice this is where life gets complicated for me especially and it's not that we're bad at making choices, we just wanna do what's familiar and what's comfortable. And what's familiar and comfortable? Well, what did you do every other day? You woke up late and you probably snoozed your alarm. So this morning you have a choice. Like, do I want to get up or do I want to snooze my alarm? Realistically, you want to snooze your alarm. Like, There's no issue with wanting to snooze your alarm because that's what you've done for more than 21 days. So for those, Whatever days, you didn't know you were forming a habit. So now waking up late and then snoozing your alarm is a habit and your body's used to it, your body's comfortable with it. That's what your body knows. What if we make another choice? What if we make another choice? How do we do that? We all have habit loops. There's a cue, there's a routine, there's a reward. I'm just gonna like literally read this for you because I don't wanna give you false information and I'm not like, I'm a neuroscientist, but <laughs> Barely. The cue is what triggers or kicks in that habitual behavior. So for us, the cue is going to be the alarm clock. So when the alarm clock goes off, that's our cue to what? Wake up, right? What's the routine? The routine is the habitual behavior that we do when we when the cue goes up. Okay. So if the alarm goes off, what's our behavior? Snooze. What's the reward? This is this is what the behavior does for you. And in our mind, we think that the reward is the fact that we get more sleep. We feel better. We get five more minutes, 10 more minutes, 15 more minutes, which think about it. What's 15 more minutes gonna really do, babes? Probably not that much, but hear me out. Let's go back to the habit loop, right? The cue's the alarm, the routine is the snooze, the reward is more sleep. The cue is the alarm, and we have to associate another routine. And this is where it gets difficult. This is where it gets complicated because it's like your body is so used to doing what it's always done. We have the same cue. You can do a different cue if you'd like. Sometimes it's good to switch it up. The routine. Now we want to get up and put on our workout clothes. Or this is a better one because I like to do this one. And the routine was get up and immediately make my bed, right? The reward was the fact that I'm up. I didn't snooze. I was respectful of my wants and wishes, which is important, self-respect. And secondly, now my bed's made, my room looks good. I'm not gonna get in my bed for probably a lot of the day. Like I'm not gonna wanna get right back in my bed. I just made it, you know? And the reward is so much more. The reward is the fact that I made my bed, my room looks good. I'm up and at them. I'm gonna put my clothes on, I'm gonna go to the gym. Usually our reward is to feel better. As humans, we love to feel better. So if the cue is the alarm and the routine is making your bed, putting on the workout clothes, the reward is feeling better because you stay true to what you wanted to do. You stay true to your desires of waking up, getting your day started. But the important thing is that we've respected our wishes. We were able to listen to what we wanted was to wake up. We acted on it and we stayed true to our wishes. And for me, that's more of the reward. So I don't even really know how I got into this conversation, but I hope it helps someone. And if anyone has, is dealing with habits, please comment down below because I love talking about habits. We think we're stuck, but we're not. And the brain is so good at changing and rewiring itself. Give it the benefit of the doubt because it will and you can. All right. <laughs> Is it my speakers? Like, what's going on? Really running 
getting on the trail. I ran for four minutes. Last week, or was it two weeks ago, I was only at, I could only run for a minute 30. I remember a minute 30. Yeah. I mean, like, because I watched the vlog. We are working our way up, so I ran Period. for four minutes. I pumped it out. Then I did my strengthening. Now, we're going to organize the fridge slash kitchen. Most this is our fridge. Fridge tour. I'm screaming. <laughs> I don't even know what's in it, girl. Let's get involved. <laughs> Let's get into it. Hi guys, good morning. Good morning. I hope you're having a good one. Um, yeah. I'm sorry, I didn't greet you. I was a little rude. <laughs> As you guys know, we did. We did a massive order for the living room, but we also did a massive order for the kitchen from the container store. Is it? The container store has not sponsored. The container store has like, but it should be. It should be though. Like we bought everything that they actually had available. Are we gonna put it on the counter when we take it off? Damn! Yeah. Like we be eating a waterfall. Jalen, you've been going crazy. My mom is obsessed with the koi. I can't get on it because I'm a sugar girl. Mm. I love you can add your own sugar. It's like so bad for me. Look at that, guys. And then you can put stuff on top of it. How nice. And it just slides right out. We love the container store. Raina loves the container store. This is yours. <laughs> This fridge is also pissing me off. I know. <laughs> Guys, look. So we have like, I don't know, miscellaneous breads, wraps, spreads, and cheeses, yogurt. Our little wine bottle, water, the eggs that. How nice is that? Wow, and then just one little cry. Tomato peppers, fun, fun. And then we got factors in the back, leftovers, lettuce, oh, and cheeses and meats. Then the door, like whatever, you know? Now we're building mm -hmm. under sink storage thing. Vertical inside. No, literally. This is what organization is like. I didn't even know we had this. I'm done. Wow, guys! Makes my heart so happy. Yeah. That was much better. Very easy. And this is the little organizer. Adults, adults, and a whatever. Currently, this is how our knives yes. are being kept, and like honestly, very dangerous. It is like very. Every time I reach in here, I'm like, oh, that's okay. She's just raw dogging. Okay. You know, sometimes you just gotta get in there. That's actually kind of crazy. Look at her knives. Two thumbs up from Maya. Two. Two. We have this because they you know, sent it to us by accident. Wow. Oh, gosh. <laughs> this is always a Getting back just now was like a double edged sword because you're like so excited to open it and then you're like, <sighs> yeah. Okay, guys, wow, that was great. Been meaning to do that for a while now, so I'm happy. Yes. We did it! Now we gotta like actually clean up. <laughs> you know. It may not mean nothing to y'all. Understand nothing was done for me. So I don't plan on stopping at all. I want to see forever, my name.
write captions for all my clients for their content calendar that i'm preparing so we're gonna do it we're gonna do it y'all it's the way that i turn off the camera <laughs> and i told maya about the app i was like oh yeah like the structured app like this is what i'm using to see my schedule or whatever she goes oh like download it right she's now. like i'm literally about to download it right now and i'm like yes because of an influence this is useful like even me just being like, okay, like this is what I did today. It does look useful because I normally like try to time block on paper, mm -hmm. but I like to it's got little gadgets. Yeah, I like fill up the time. Right. I love gadgets. I haven't scheduled the rest of my day, which is bad, but it says I have 10 hours and 30 minutes until I my I put in that I go to sleep. So it's like. What time do you put in that I go to sleep? 12.15. Damn. Realistically. That's when you're going to go to bed. Like, I'm being realistic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. That's good. Because we'll get it, we'll get it down eventually. What time do you go to bed? Like the goal should be 10, 30, 11. That should be the goal. 10, 30, the, 10, the latest should be the goal. To Bro, I'm, I'm going from 2 a.m. Right. That's what I'm saying. We'll slowly get you there, but you're going to get to 10. We'll get you to 10. Because what time did you put to wake up? 7.30. You don't actually need okay, so this is a whole myth. I don't want to blockbuster us right now with my chapped lips, but it's a myth that you need eight hours of sleep. When I I can always tell my body's like only give me five hours. But yeah, but like but also I do know like oversleeping sucks. Like when you go from twelve to twelve, mm -hmm. then that's terrible. But it's not about like okay, so I mean like let me just block I need lip balm before I get into this because I know like I The neuroscientist is about to give us the taste. <laughs> Carmax, they need to sponsor me. I would quickly do a Carmax. Oh my god, like you don't know. I have eight tubes in my room, all over. God damn, they break me out. Obviously, you know you're going through different sleep cycles. Yeah. So it's like you can get as many sleep cycles in, like, but you don't want to wake up in the middle of a sleep cycle. Right. Waking up in the middle of sleep cycle is what you feel up when you're like, I woke up and I feel like absolute like poop because I didn't finish the like REM one, two, three, yeah. whatever. So. The what about when they say like your body repairs itself in your sleep? It does. So like, isn't it like you want the most time to repair it? You want like, you don't need eight hours though. Mm -hmm. I only know this because I worked with, literally his name was this, like, America's what? Sleep Doctor. He's like, I know that my body needs six hours of sleep. It's really just about like figuring out what you need. Mm -hmm. And so like, you may say like, okay, yeah, you need eight <laughs> hours, but it's also like, we've heard that we needed eight hours. It's, they identify the four chronotypes as animals. Yeah. So there's the dolphin, the lion, the bear, and the wolf. And everyone has a different chronotype. And your chronotype is basically, like, you know when you say like, you're an early bird, you're a night owl, like that's real. Like some people actually like function better in the morning versus some yeah. people function better at night. The chronotypes is like, how do you get good sleep? Okay. Like how are you supposed to get good sleep based on your biology? So each chronotype has a preferred schedule and the chronotype is your body's natural disposition to be awake or asleep at certain times. And that's related to your circadian rhythm. Mm. Do you know what that is? 
I've heard the word. It has to do with your melatonin production. Uh. I was like, melatonin. Yeah. I was like, oh, melatonin gummies. is like the gummies. Yeah, like exactly the, the gummies. gummies. It's, yeah. ex- it's already naturally produced in your body. Melatonin production is affected on your daily basis. Like you can produce more or less melatonin based on like your activity. Your circadian rhythm is influenced by light exposure. Mm. So the, like how the sun rises and sets, okay. that's like your natural, like body's disposition to sleep. How do I say this simply? Cause this is getting mm-hmm. very like involved. Because your, your chronotype isn't affected by the sun, it's affected by your genes. So like you already have a disposition of like you like if you like you think you're a night owl or early like early you're an early bird. So like your chronotype is saying like you are an early riser. Like mm-hmm. that's in your genes. Is your mom also an early riser? Yes. So like you see what I'm saying like that's in your genes. It's important to work with your chronotype of like what you are like an early bird or a night owl rather than against it if you're saying like well you can just go to bed like. Go to bed earlier. If it's just not in your genes, it's like yeah, it doesn't work with them. Exactly. Yeah. That was like the best way to like explain sleep. Sleep is so hard. Like sleep is like after I started hearing people talk about sleep, I was like, oh, like it's not just it's not just you going to bed and restoring and waking yeah. up. Like it's a lot. Like there's everyone's different. You could all should look up your chronotypes. I mean, like go figure out what type of chronotype you are because they have like different schedules and also different windows of productivity which is what the video is about i mean like wow look at that um and obviously like those windows help you function best like you might work better at night and you say like oh i just work better at night but like you actually might work better at night because that's what your genes allow versus someone who really works better in the morning does that make sense i forget i sense to me period and I'm the dumbest you could get. No. Like, yeah. Don't. Oh, so like, it's good. So you could try it out on me and like, I'm pretty low bar, <laughs> which is okay. Like, I'm not the bottom of the barrel, but I'm pretty low bar. I'm cheated my entire way through biology. So no, you didn't have a teacher. Oh, for you. <laughs> That's not but your fault. If you hit me up about history, I got it too. I don't. I couldn't. Because I'm a Columbus, 1492. Say I don't know. Oh, shit. Blue, period. <laughs> Trade, I got you. No, we don't want to talk about the slave trade. <laughs> <laughs> do not want to talk about the slave trade. It says, I was going to say you're the bear, and the bear is the most common chronotype. About 55% of people have the bear chronotype. People with this immediate chronotype or intermediate chronotype are generally more productive before noon and begin feeling decline in energy in the late afternoon and begin winding down for sleep in the early evening. And then the sleep cycle is aligned with the sun, so it's more natural for you to rise and set with the sun as well. Yeah, I feel like I'm the opposite of that. Because remember when I'm like, I get that kick at 10? Yeah. That's real. That shit real. Like, I feel that. Yeah. I feel like I do have more energy at night. I just be doing listening to it. I'm going to take the test. I've never taken it. I don't know how I've gone this long without taking the test. I'm the bear. I'm typical. What does that mean, though? I didn't think I was the bear. She said... You're like most girls. <laughs> no, like I'm like all the other girls. Like I'm like 55% of the population. And I just felt like I was special. You know what I mean? It's okay. You're special in other ways. Thank you. <laughs> Who knows if I'm gonna leave any of this about the sleep? I feel like I'm probably just gonna cut it all out. No, you're not. You're not. <laughs> hey vlog, she's not. Future Reina editing this, you're not. Be like no, I'm definitely the wolf. Okay, let me tell you who the wolf is. <laughs> you're like, Maybe actually, I'm just, no, like, you're wrong. You're wrong. I just did this for 10 minutes, but no, you're literally wrong. you're wrong. People with the wolf are most energetic waking up later in the day. Oh. I'm not, though. Energetic. Yeah. Later. Later. I see. I am I was understanding it wrong. I would sleep in later, but I wouldn't be productive. It would, like, really ruin my day. Interesting. All right, guys. Well, that was... That was that. Hey vlog, such a long day and I still hadn't tackled my bedroom. Okay, it's five now. I still have more things to write. I still have more things to do. I need more lip gloss because I can't, I, I can't, I just can't. Oh, this is the shade Mapleton by Mirror. I can eat, I've used so much, but I really like it. Look at that color. You like, look at that. I need like 
I need dessert. <laughs> So I've not started editing Miranda's vlog. I've not started editing at all. And it needs to be done in less than two hours. Hey, hey, what a, ooh, what a, mm, mm. In order to just feel like I'm the productive girl, I need to do laundry. Okay, and all the laundry in my basket's actually clean, which is so unfortunate. But I've been throwing my clothes on the ground. Like, let's be real, okay? Like, I, I can't even fake it right now because I've been throwing my stuff on the ground because I'm just like, well, where does the dirty clothes go if my hamper is full of clean clothes? On the ground, of course. We're gonna pick it up, we're gonna do what we gotta do, figure it out. Um, I'm working client stuff still. I had to do another client's work in terms of they had a course coming out today and so I had to do all that posting and stories and it wasn't really that planned. So I didn't account for it, but now, okay, we're writing captions and captions take a really long time because I like to take, like tell a story in the captions. Not tell a story, but like just give a little bit more than just like do 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 emojis. Cause I feel like a lot of my clients have like a large messaging. And so I need to get it across. Longer captions to me just like have more of a reach and people can form a connection to you. How good does this look? It's one from Costco. Like it's a, it's so good. It's frozen. It comes like six in a pack, and they're so good when like you're on the go and you just need to like, you know. So that's where I'm at. My dryer, my washer. I meant to say my laundry. And when I started productive, y'all thought I was kidding. We're trying to get our life together. I can't believe my life is real sometimes. I'm like, ooh. Like, I wonder what it looks like from your perspective. Probably looks scary. And it's not good. When I first saw these at Trader Joe's, I was like, are they for kids? And then I was like, I'm gonna still get them. And then I tried them and I was like, no, they're not for kids. It should be cold though. Can you just refrigerate these? After opening, we're back. I didn't update you guys, my hair looks crazy. We're editing now. Yeah, honestly, I'm surprised I'm editing during the day. Like, but, like I just edit when it's dark out. But Maya's also editing. So we're both editing. And I have two hours and 30 more minutes. And I'm just chit chatting. Like I need to stop talking so much in these videos. Like, let me know if you like the longer videos. Cause if not, I'll stop talking. Okay. Cause two hours and 30 minutes of what? Like, what was I saying? I don't know. Basically it's 8.40. I'm still here. At least I'm still alive. You know what I mean? Like, but I'm still editing. I'm at an hour 44, but I'm at minute 31. But this time lapse is 28 minutes. Jeez. Hey girl. Hey. Hey. I'm, I'm, in. I'm not a Caucasian. I swear. <laughs> I'm black. I'm black. I love it. Oh no, I'm supposed oh to. Oh yeah, I'm excited. Hey y'all. Good morning. <laughs> it's 12:57. It's not morning. It's the next day. You've seen the vlog. I'm currently editing the video. I woke up at 6:30. Went back to sleep for a little bit, and then started editing at 7. It's one. Maya went out to brunch with our friend. Couldn't go, because I have work. And I'm still editing. Hopefully, I'm really trying to be done with this in the next 30 minutes so I could export, upload. That's where I'm gonna take another hour. Like, we got a lot of things to do. I have a lot of work to do. That's the update. And I have to take, I still need to take some clips for my camera to put on. I can't, I gotta go.